All right, what we got from Big Atomic? We got from Big Atomic. Big Daddy Tom Tom. Every diss from Eminem's Music to Be Murdered to album? Oh, snap. Hold on. How do you do, ladies what and the gentlemen? Fuck? My name is Alfred Hitchcock, and this is Music to Be Murdered by. They said my last album I sounded bitter. No, I sound like a spitter. Ninety percent of these hypocrites are trying to get rid of. But why would I get a chip on my shoulder? I was considered one time as the illest. Bitch, I'm still as fly as a zipper. Homie, we get it. We know that you're the greatest rapper alive. Fucking dweeb, all you do is read the dictionary and stay inside. Better watch for Slim, gonna get the pop and when I. I still cannot believe that there was like, there was just a bar. Like, who who told MGK to drop that shit, bro? Fucking dweeb, all you do is read the dictionary and stay inside. Better watch for Slim, gonna get the pop and when I'm at the top, I get them on top of them. Give it to anyone who wanna come get it, and I'm not gonna stop. But when they ask me, is the war finished with MGK? Of course it is. I cleanse them if it's mortal sins. I'm God and the Lord forgives even Ugh. the devil worshippers. Fuck rap God, I'm the rap devil. Come a bare face with a black shovel like the Armageddon. When the smoke settle, his body next to this instrumental. I'm saying, I'm sick of them sweatsuits and them corny hats. Let's talk about it. I'm sick of you being rich and you still mad. Let's talk about it. True, I just get richer, but if it was ever all about thriller, then I would have quit a long motherfucking time ago. Bitch, shut the fuck up. I should go say that shit to Tech Nine or the Jigger. Nobody says shit about two chains as long as he's been here. So tell me, what are you staying for? What? I know you can't stand yourself, bro. Trying to be the old you so bad, you stand yourself out. Let's leave all the beef in the 50. Please. M to push a 50. Why you claiming I'm a call puff when you the one that called Diddy? I can keep beefing. Ah. Oh. Ah, oh, that didn't age well. Shit. Fuck is the point. I can make it really difficult for motherfuckers to come to Detroit. If you're still looking for smoke, I already gave you an L. I'd rather just see you in hell. But I should get puff on a joint. Oh, you want <sighs> Are there are there people that like actively go like I would want to go to Detroit? I don't know if there's ever been a time in my life where I've been like I think I'm missing something. I should probably go to Detroit. Never in my fucking life. Never in my life. Now, I'd rather just see you in hell, but I should get No, I remember. I remember, Mark. I was just talking about because all the jokes that Diddy's getting right now. You know, I was just being childish. Puff on a joint. Oh, you want some fucking smoke, but not literally you'll choke. Yeah, I'll acknowledge you're the goat, but I'm the gunner, bitch. I got you in the scope. Don't have a heart attack now. Somebody help your mans up. Knees weak or old age. The real Slim Shady can't stand up. You're not getting better with time. It's fine, Eminem. Put down the pen. Because lately, instead of us being credited for longevity and being able to keep it up for this long at this level, we get told we'll never be what we were, bitch. If I was this half as good as I was, I'm still twice as good as you'll ever be. Bro. I gotta respect the OGs, and I know most of them personally. Hey, but you just a bully acting like a baby, so I gotta read you a nursery. I'm the ghost of the future, and you just have the knees of Scrooge. I said I'm flex, that anyone can get it. I ain't know it would be you. They said I'm just a whiner. I sound like a baby. I, I still be so confused, because it's almost like, like, MGK act like Eminem just came out of nowhere and just started shitting on him for no reason. Like, and now I really go back and think about it, like, it, wasn't that crazy? This shit out, but can't take it, but I take it, this shit back out. Oh, you, you do a lot of ages when it comes to Eminem. Like, you know you're gonna get <laughs> oh, you're insane. Oh, absolutely. But the yeah. thing is, I'm not a hypocrite. I said it in Rap Devil. I gotta respect the OGs. I'm not a hypocrite. M, push a 50. Don't have a heart attack now. I'm not a hypocrite. Respect the OGs. I'm not a hypocrite. Somebody help your mans up. Knees weak or old age. The real Slim Shady can't stand up. I gotta respect the OGs. I'm not a hypocrite. About to be 46 years old, dog. I'm not a hypocrite. I gotta respect the OGs. I'm not a hypocrite. I'm twice as young as you. Can we just pour some out for this old dumbass? I'm a sight. you can see from the ring. I'm wearing me in this game. We got married already. Had the prenup ready. Fucked on us and I seen her belly. She barely was three months pregnant. Bitch had it. Gave me a baby. We named it Machine Gun Kelly. Mm. Do you feel like a stan? It I'm a white boy who's bitch. in a predominantly black neighborhood. Definitely in a predominantly black industry. Mm. Absolutely, I'm fucking with Eminem growing up. It's all there. I'm moving on, but you know your scruples are gone when you're born with Lucifer's horns and you're from the school of notorious Puba Cuban the poor. I just teach us two to my students, show them all the blueprint and formula, but it seems like the more they study. 
I forgot how fucking cold this nigga was. Oh my god. Moving on, but you know your scruples are gone when you're born with Lucifer's horns and you're from the school in notorious Puba Cube in the poor. I just teach us two to my students, show them all the blue green mm -hmm. formula. But it seems like the more they study my music, the more they remind me of eyeballs. I'm watching my pupils get cornier. Hello, Marshall. My name's Colson. You should go back to recovery. Still can't cover up the facts. Your last four hours is bad as a selfie. Now tell me. I sound like four mil when I put out a bad album. Revival flop came back and I scared the crap out of them. Okay, Oscar the Grouch, chill on the couch. You got an Oscar, damn. Can anyone else get some food in their mouth for real? They made a movie about you. You and everybody's top ten. Shit, no wonder you're mad now. I'm looking at them plaques, count them. I'm LL Cool J, bigger and deafer, that's how I'm... <laughs> Wait. <laughs> That was my shit. Wait, what? My dad literally had that tape. He had that tape, nigga. That shit was a fucking bop, bro. LL used to be so sick. Oh, my. God. I don't think that nigga can lose. I don't. I don't care what nobody say, bro. LL is that nigga, bro. LL is that nigga. The best rapper you've heard. News Flash M. I heard the album. Let me tell you what Joe Budden has thought this entire time. I've been better than you this entire fucking decade. Yeah, those days are over. Scrape a change in sofas. Trying to save it, Kroger. So why would I give a fuck about that? I've been traded, Joe, for. Call Kim, somebody get Haley and that other kid you raising that ain't even your baby. Took a page out of Drake book. This might get a Grammy. We going back to back till you respond on the family. They talk about my daughters hoping to fly y'all for the handle. Handles. My first thought is to trample the red a thousand bars, but sometimes it's like dropping an anvil on a house of cards or guts of a squash and a crouton with combat boots on or dropping a goddamn new bomb on top of an anthill. I call the tricks and the gimmicks. You like the new white supremacist. Bro, there was this many. Oh, you understand like how crazy it is to think that Nick Cannon was trying to put bars on him. Oh, ew. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. I would have saw this. It would have took me 10 years to respond to this. If I was him, oh, my God. I would have been like, because like, every time I thought about it, I would have just been so perplexed. Like, Nick Cannon, Joe Budden? <laughs> nah. <laughs> nah. But you cannot knock the fact that he is one of the kings of rap. You gotta give him that. Nigga, you ain't no lyricist. His skills spoke for themselves. You cannot negate his ability. Nigga, you ain't no lyricist. His ability is second to none. Last album. The album's, album's like. Yeah. Oh my God. He's he's definitely gonna go on the Mount Rushmore of rap as one of the kings. Nigga, you ain't no lyricist. Innocent bystanders, I'm bound to get some adversaries. I carry big guns, so some targets to get the kill shot. Some I just barely nicked them. I'm trying to find out who the fuck. This pest in our house. When you have a white artist doing black music, white people just gravitate to that crazily. Just like in Eminem, we had a lot of people talking about, is Eminem a guest in the house of hip hop? You motherfucking right he is. Just because he sold the most records and all of that. That's what I'd be so confused. Like, how do you, how can you tell Eminem that he's a guest? Like, if Eminem came out today, he would be a guest in hip hop, nigga. That nigga was in the game. Like, what are we talking about? What are we talking like there ain't nobody in this I don't know if there's a white person in this world that has showed as much homage, love, and respect for the rap game as Eminem. Like, is does that exist? I'd be so confused. It may be my own people, bro. I'd be trying to understand it. Like, where where does all this where does it where does the hate come from? There's so many black artists that are out that are out here killing the game. And it's almost like people get mad because they think that it takes something away from them because you give Eminem some type of praise, bro. Like, relax. Gotta be the greatest white boy to ever do it, right? Gotta be. I ain't never heard nobody better. What are we talking about? I'm more than you bargain for, and I am far more worse than a 40 some bar Lord Jamar verse. And nothing means more than respect. So when I curse, you can say I swore to protect my image. I have zero time to regard. What about this nigga Eminem, said Lil the Mama. greatest rapper of all time, the greatest, the king of hip-hop? Is he a guest? 
I said, what? First of all, this motherfucker is not the fucking greatest of all time. He's not the king of hip hop. And yes, motherfucker, he's a guest. I never was being claimed and rap when it's not yours. If it was anyone's house, you rapping rock, Kim would be having you mock floors. When DMC would be having you cleaning sinks. Yeah, your group was off the chain, but you were the weakest link. Oh, okay, you know what? Let me just say this. Lyrically, when it comes to putting words together, da, 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 da. So yeah. when it comes to rapping, he's better than me. I'm in your house eating carrot cake, but I sit there and wait and I marinate, I marinate. Ah, then you sit there in front of gold? He's better than me. Oh. I'm in your house eating carrot cake, but I sit there and Oh, I'd be, oh, I'd feel so disrespected. Wait and I marinate, I marinated. You about to meet a scary fate and come home to find yourself staring straight into a fucking barrel like Sharon Tate. Trace a concerto while I narrate. You couldn't be talking about my real home because... He'd be shot dead. And actually, as the homeowners in hip hop, I believe we do have the right to expel anybody that comes up in our fucking house that we do not deem a, a welcome guest. What? That's what I be saying. It's like there's so much behind Eminem shit, and I just be like, damn, this is really hard. Not even knowing all the history behind that shit, because how who even is Lord Jamar? Where did this nigga come from? I ain't never heard told it heard a nigga say put the goddamn Lord Jamar on. This is Joe Budden. Brand Nubian? Never in my life. Never in my life am I what is even that? Hoping to see me completely broken emotionally, but how in the fuck am I not supposed to be woke when these fuckers just keep poking me now? If somebody said right now Eminem is the king of rap, why would you say he's not? You got to come with a better name. Yeah. <laughs> that, that, don't even, that ain't even worth. Alright. Cause I ain't playing Eminem in my car. Man, I love Gucci. <laughs> he was one of the first people like, hey bro, we need let you wanna we can go handle it. <laughs> I was like, Gucci, Gucci like, wanted to handle Eminem. I know who the king of rap. Oh, <laughs> me. You. Only way that you're ahead of me is alphabetically, because if you diss me, I'm coming after you like the letter V. King dog. I don't like when people be trying to call me like a rapist or a rape this or rape. I don't like that shit. Yeah, I went through niggas' pockets, all right. Was I wrong for that? That's wrong, but I never fucking hurt nobody. Niggas were drug dealers and fucking scammers and shit. Hope thinks her snatch is magical, but that's how she attracts men. Though. Traps them in a text similar to an actual arachnid or a vaginal tarantula or black widow. In fact, it'll be nothing to throw that little bitch with a capital B out the back window with a black Cadillac limo, like a whack demo. Black Squad told me you made some songs. I don't remember them. Nick, you know I'm from Detroit. Don't make me call Eminem. See what I'm calling you in order to nine too volatile and too grizzly to bear. Yeah, shit is getting to wear. I can barely even sit in the chair. This is hard. I had to quit fucking with doggy feminine. I run Detroit niggas talking about Eminem. Talking that shit, I kill you, him, him. I made an M again. I made an M again. Slow down. I bust my ass for this shit, and I swear it ain't even worth dissing someone so offbeat that they can't even figure out where their words should hit the kick in the snare. Bro, you said that uh, Eminem's last album was trash because he wasn't on drugs. There's some dope concepts. It's talking about some things that matter. You know, it's a mature album, but I think it was only trash. <laughs> Daylon is so crazy, bro. Trash. And they said I'm lyrically amazing. Eminem was, wow. he picked some of the worst beats ever. Even Ludacris sometimes picks shitty beats, but uh, their energy and their cool, witty lines is what made the songs cool. So they're an exception, yeah. you know, yeah. to where Jay-Z picked great beats. No, I should hook up with Takey fans, keep on pulling me one way, hate us, pull me in, and what? hooks in me, then sway he doesn't like that. I don't like his new stuff. And he dissed me on his last album. So the fans that didn't really like it, ah, you gotta do fucking, I want the old M. I want the Marshall Mathers LPM. I want the old M. He read that and was like, damn, you know what? Fuck, let me go back and try to rehash a moment. And when people go back, that is the grossest fucking thing. Move forward. Get what you're into for real. I don't want but didn't Tyler do that? Everybody's going to be right. I'm going to go back to the old shit because that's what they want. Fuck what they want. Give them what 
you want. I can make a mistake and erupt and end up taking a dump or saying some dumb shit, thinking I run shit, misplacing my anger and nah, not because he had the first. The I should have never made a response to the disdain for the fake ones and traitorous punks because snakes are this cunts. They can get fucked with 800 motherfucking vibrators at once. Now you tell me you should, like, you should put me in a category of like Paul, Big, Nas, them niggas. Like, you feel me? Please, dog, I need y'all to keep talking shit because I feed off of it. I am the complete opposite. We talk to spit these weak bars. I'm going to leave carnage. He's thought I'd be so toxic. It'll block the wind through your esophagus. Stop it. Cutting off your oxygen. Then I hit them pads like a boxing gym. Believe it or not, love me or hate me. Young boy is is too pop, nigga. And my head says to the dream. Then he said, kill him seeds. Chippy red with pills and lean. Sipping meds in a limousine. Getting head, guillotine. My name. Do it right when you ain't diss me. I'm a lyrical legend. I know they miss me. All you mumble rap kids, colorful hair. Can't compare to the lyrical phenomenon. <laughs> that's right here. Mars, Jupiter. V I don't care what nobody says, bro. There is not a time on this earth as lit as that, like, four weeks that 6 and I was just dropping back to back. Talking the craziest shit. That shit was hilarious. Venus origins and oranges combined solar eclipse. Your mind is an eclipse of the origins. Ah. <laughs> this shit is like robber room. Why do I feel responsible for these kids? All of whom I'm a father to. I'm a god to you. Y'all better worship the water. I walk on the y'all gonna meet your water. If people yeah, start firing off, shit. and I try to answer every fucking body that I dislike, I'm a god. Words about. I'm gonna be going the next five fucking years <laughs> making this song after this song. You know what I'm saying? So, yeah. like, you're gonna get hit though. Killing everything, play this oh. eulogy. It's a funeral. Prepare to die. This is music for you to be murdered by. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. Solid. That was hard. Shout out to the homie. Who's this? Hip hop who? They put a fire ass. Hip hop universe TV. They went stupid on that. That was a great. Great, great video. Wow. Oh, shout out Atomic, dude. Come on.